Reverb 2 simulates acoustic spaces. If you clap your hands in a bathroom or concert hall, the sound is quite different. This is due to the fact that in enclosed spaces, reflections build up and overlap to create a reverberant sound. Reverb 2 parameters allow you to simulate different types of acoustic spaces. If you wish to give your acoustic instruments a live feel, then use of reverb is critical. The set, tap the main and tune tabs to access. In the main section we have high cut, low cut, size, diffusion decay. Amping, dry, early reflect and wet knob. High cut is used to remove high frequencies from the reverb. Low cut is used to remove the rumble and mudness from the low frequencies of reverb. Set the size of the virtual room. The room size should be adjusted according to the decay. Time. Large rooms sound better with a longer decay time, and the small rooms sound better with short decay times. Diffusion controls the density of the reflections bouncing off the walls of the virtual room. Low diffusion makes the sound more distinct, and high diffusion makes the sound like the constant decaying noise. Decay is the time it takes for the reverb signal to fade. Use low decay times for small rooms and long decay times for large rooms. Amping is the rate at which the high frequencies decay. This effect causes the sound to become gradually muffled and warmer. Dry is the level of the dry input signal mixed back into the output. Early reflection is the relative level of the first reflections in the reverb. These give you a sense of the size of the room. The amount of reverberant sound mixed in with the dry input is what amount. Value 0 is 100% dry. 50 is a 50% mix of dry plus reverb, and 100 is 100% reverb with no dry signal. In the tune section we have side input, delay, tempo, mod, speed, bass, cross, separation, and pan. Side input is to process the center or stereo components of the input signal. Off mode is for center processing and on mode is for stereo processing of the signal.
Pre-delay controls the delay time between the direct input signal and the first reverb. Reflection. Tempo is to select a tempo-based pre-delay, so the initial sound will be in time with a beat. Mod is to modulate the reverb time to break up metallic ringing sounds associated with artificial reverb. Bass is for adjusts the decay time of the bass frequencies in the reverb. Adjust the stereo separation of the wet reverb signal. Panning for the reverb part of the signal. This Reverb 2 effect is pretty much similar to the FL Studio Reverb 2. And with this reverb you can make your song more interesting. In the next video I'll show you how to use. Delay. Thanks for watching the video. See you soon.